House is set to vote to renew a crucial national security spy program that is set to expire next week. The focus is on the Foreign Intelligence Surveillance Act, also known as FISA. Coming as the FBI warns, there is growing concern of an ISIS attack right here on our own American turf. Tom Dempsey has more from the Capitol this morning. Tom, FBI Director Christopher Wray says dropping this program would put American lives at risk. Hey, good morning, Marky. Yeah, a very big warning coming from the FBI director saying that losing FISA could potentially lead to a possible terror attack here in the United States. The FBI director saying that the most immediate threat right now could be a coordinated attack similar to the one seen in Russia a few weeks ago that killed almost 150 people. ISIS-K, an offshoot of the uh, terrorist group in Afghanistan, carried out that attack, and it's known for its worse brutality than ISIS. And just this week, police arrested an 18-year-old for planning attacks at churches in Idaho, all in the name of ISIS. Also, as News Nation first reported, at least four suspected terrorists have been arrested after entering the U.S. illegally. Without FISA, the FBI director says intelligence agencies would lose a vital tool to keep Americans safe. And with fighting in Gaza, Yemen, Ukraine, and elsewhere, he says losing FISA couldn't come at a worse time. As I look back over my career in law enforcement, I would be hard pressed to think of a time where so many threats to our public safety and national security were so elevated all at once. Now, adding on to the urgency of all this, FISA expires in a week. And uh, later today here on Capitol Hill, Congress will be voting on extending uh, FISA. Uh, Section 702 has brought a lot of debate. And basically what that does is it allows uh, for, uh, intelligence agencies here in the United States to spy on foreign targets uh, in other countries. But some Republicans have raised a lot of concerns saying that Americans could be spied on without a warrant if they're tied up in any investigations overseas. Again, we're expecting... Uh, that vote to reauthorize FISA in a few hours here on Capitol Hill, Marky. Yeah. Thanks for watching, everybody. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. Also, don't forget to click that red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.